What is up there guys? My name is Chase Reiner and today I'm going to show you the top easy part-time online jobs that pay 200 plus an hour, which I've basically been able to do in the last year and make close to $62,000 just on Stripe. On PayPal, I made I think like 100,000 and these are things that you can do at pretty much any age. I'm 24 right now. I've made over $150,000 in the last year doing this sort of stuff. So if you like this t these type of videos and you want to see more in the future, make sure you leave a thumbs up. So we're just going to dive right into it. Here again is the Stripe uh, account. You can see just today I got $438 deposited. Uh, and this is from one of the things that I actually am going to show you in here. Now in the middle of this presentation, I'm going to give you guys a free gift. So make sure you stick around. And last but not least, if you also want to get notified when I do live streams like this, all of my videos are generally live. So all you have to do is just go ahead and hit this little bell icon next to the subscribe button and then you'll actually get notified. So number one is Google My Business Optimization. So if you don't know what that is, Google My Business Optimization is taking a online business, like a Google My Business and optimizing it for a business. So I'll show you guys what that looks like right now. Let me just go into here. So you can see this. So we'll go to Google. Uh, well, let's just look up iPhone repair and we'll just look for near me. Now, unfortunately, I already have the top ranking business for this. Well, actually I did for iPhone repair Santa Barbara, but uh, for say this business, or let's say a business that's lower down. Let's say for instance, this one or one that you can see that's clearly not doing any optimizations, like there's no star ratings, uh, there's no pictures, whatever. Uh, generally, if there's not really much going on with their lo like their location, it's really easy to tell. Uh, let's check for something that's less optimized. Usually tech companies are, u are generally more optimized. Let's look for like lawyers. So let's say for instance, like these people. So you can see here, they don't. E they haven't even claimed the business yet, which to claim it, all you just do is click on own this business and then follow the steps that you just send them a letter. Once they get it verified, all you have to do is sign into the account and then start doing like certain things like uploading photos. It's really easy. I'll show you how to do it. So we'll go to Google my business. I'll show you how I did this for the iPhone repair. And if you look up iPhone repair near me, it's not number one, but if you look up iPhone repair Santa Barbara, which is its main keywords, uh, it shows up number one. Now I actually sold this business for $3,000 about four or five months ago. So it's not my business anymore, but uh, that's another thing you could do is you could rank these businesses and then sell them if you'd want to. We're not going to cover that topic today, but uh, we will be covering other easier topics that you can pretty much do if you haven't even really done anything online before. So I'll show you how I optimize that. Let's just go to Google my business. We're going to sign in. We're going to go to manage. We're going to find the Google business. So let's look for iPhone repair. There it is. Press on manage. And then what you're going to do is all, all you really have to do is go to photos. Uh, start adding photos with the correct file URL. So say for instance, you had a fic picture of outside of your location, you would just take that image and name it outside of location.jpg. So you would just redo the title. You would just go press rename like this, edit. Oops, sorry, that just edited the entire photo. Trying to rename it. Uh, properties, take this and call it, you know, outside of location. So generally just by adding a bunch of photos of a business, just going and taking pictures with your iPhone or whatever, it's going to help them rank higher on Google or the business rank higher on Google. All you have to do is just follow right here, interior, exterior, at work, whatever. Uh, if you guys forget how to do this and you want to know like m more detail how to actually go and, you know, completely optimize Google My Business, you can just go to YouTube, type in Google My Business Optimization 2000. 18 
or whatever date if this is 2019 uh, and then you would click on it and just go ahead and watch how I go and optimize the Google my business so that's one way you can easily start charging 200 an hour I mean it only takes like an hour to optimize these things but somebody will pay you $200 to go and optimize their Google My Business because they don't know how to. So you can easily watch that hour long video that I have on Google My Business optimization, go and optimize somebody's business, go claim their business for them, tell them that generally this will help them rank a couple spots higher on Google and bring them more traffic. So it's something that's really easy to do and you can, write, you can do right away without really knowing anything. Cool, so number two, we got review generation. So uh, the free, gift I'm going to give you is after this tip. So just stick around, but review generation is something that people will also pay for. Uh, this is also something that you're going to do for Google, my business, and it'll help it rank higher usually just by doing reviews. So I always say that reviews are probably like 40, 50% of the reason why businesses rank. Uh, if we look at, for instance, the iPhone repair, you can see here that it's the highest rated, uh, iPhone company besides this one in Santa Barbara. So the way we got these reviews is really simple. Uh, you have a couple options. So one of my favorite options is the option I use on this channel. What I'll do is I'll do a video or I'll do some sort of free content for like a business. And then in the video, I'll say, by the way, make sure you subscribe, make sure you, uh, join our Facebook group, whatever it is. And then once you get the person's contact info that subscribes, so say for instance, I go to YouTube and I look at my subscribers and I go, let's, let's log into YouTube. We're going to go to creator studio. And then we're going to go to community. And, and so you can see these people who are messaging me or her leaving comments, I could easily just go out and message them just by going to their profile. And usually they'll have their contact info on there too. Um, for some reason, I guess I can't message this person. I don't know why, uh, but let's just say for instance, subscribers, let's go to subscribers. You can see there's a little actions that says send message. So what you're going to do is you're going to go and say, Hey, QL world TV. I saw you watched or you subscribed to my YouTube channel. Perhaps you could leave me a review on the SEO I teach or whatever I give away for free, right? Or maybe people buy stuff, you know, uh, and they watch stuff on my channel, I, whatever it is. So you're just going to go ahead and do that. Grab your Google link. If you want to shorten it, you can. The best way to do this is just to go to grade.us. Uh, you're going to go ahead and get to the review gen generator, grade.us review generator. I don't know why it's not popping that popping up right now. There it is. We're going to type in the business name that you're trying to get the review for. Type in the zip code. And for some reason it doesn't show up for my name, but it shows up for like SEO Santa Barbara Chase Reiner or something. Uh, you kind of have to fiddle with it until you get it. Uh, another option is you can just go ahead and grab this link and then just do Google URL shortener. It'll do the same thing if you can't get that. Cause sometimes people have problems with that. So we just copy that, boom, there it is. There's the pop-up. So what you would do you press send and now you can start collecting reviews. Now, like I said, you can do this from YouTube subscribers. You can get this to, from people who uh, join a mailing list, uh, whatever it is, Facebook people, anybody who really knows about your business or has had an experience with it or something along those lines, uh, you're going to be able to get reviews and you could easily start charging for that. Um, like within, you know, days, uh, because it's so easy to get reviews these days. The problem is, is that most people don't think outside the box and they only message their direct customers, which most of those people are really busy. That's why they buy from you. Um, and they also feel like they've already spent money with you so that they don't feel obligated to leave you a review because they've already given you something. But if you are helping people, there's no reason why they shouldn't be able to also leave you a review, whether or not they paid. It doesn't have to be somebody who paid. Um, now you don't want to go and exchange like, like, uh, you know, free products for, 
for reviews. You don't want to say, hey, I'll give you a gift card if you leave me a review, but you do want to go out and do content. And then also you can rank for that content if you are getting into SEO, which that's a different subject. If you want to learn more about SEO, you can learn about that on this channel. So review generation, that's an easy way to start making 200 bucks an hour. People will pay you literally that if you can help them make uh, you know, their business rank within like a month by getting them 30 to 60 reviews with this simple method. So number three, website audit. And this is the thing that I'm going to give away for free in a second. So make sure you stick around. Uh, what you're going to do for this is you're going to audit somebody's website and it's going to be pretty straightforward. All you have to do for this is tell people the things that are going wrong with their website and then you can outsource easily uh, things to fix to other people who know more about what you know, you're know you selling uh, than you do. So say for instance, you wanted to charge $200 for an SEO audit or for a web design audit or whatever it is on somebody's website. You can download this template that I'm gonna give you for free. Um, sorry, I got cut off a little bit. I don't know why it's cut off, but it says get the checklist uh, light version for free and this is not the complete version but it's just enough for free that will let you go ahead and start auditing people's websites now if you want the premium version you can get that uh it is worth it's only 49 bucks uh and then you also get this you know exclusive membership to my facebook groups but we'll talk about that in a little bit um, i'm just going to show you the free thing that you're going to get right now so if you head over to the link in the description uh, you're going to be able to get the free SEO audit template. So let me go over to chaserunner.com and I'll show you how to use it. So you're going to go click on the link. You're going to get the SEO audit checklist. You're going to download the light version here. All you have to do is put in your email address. So you click on that. It'll give you a direct download right there in the bottom. What you're going to do is you're going to open it up and then you're going to watch the video walkthrough. So this video walkthrough will let you know how to use this template. Once you know how to use the template, all you're gonna do is just follow the instructions that show you what to check for for different problems. Now, if this is too confusing, you don't have to use this template. This template is for people who know a, t a tiny bit about SEO. If you don't know anything about SEO, um, I would check out my beginner to advanced tutorials first. Uh, they are on my first playlist on my YouTube channel. Otherwise, what you will do is just go ahead and do a simple on-page checker. What you can do for that is just look up something like SEO Centro. And you're going to look up something like a lawyer's website. So let's look up lawyers Santa Barbara again. We're going to look for somebody who's ranking on the you know, third or fourth page. Obviously, they're not doing SEO if they're ranking so far down. You're going to copy their URL. You're going to go to SEO Analyzer and then look up how this is scoring with this checker. If it's scoring really terribly, you can download with this print button a report and you can call them and tell them all the things that are going wrong with their website. Like for instance, their title tags are too long. Um, you can see they're being, you know, deprecated on, or truncated on the search results. That's what it looks like. You know, that doesn't look good. Um, if we go to the next one, you know, uh, you know, certain things are happening, like the content's too long, or, or not the content, but the page size is too long. Um, so on and so on. This is a really minimal check. Uh, this is for like complete beginners. If you've never done SEO before. Uh, once you start getting a little bit more advanced, I would check out this free tool called Screaming Frog. And Screaming Frog will let you do an entire site analysis up to 500 pages for free. If you want to see a Screaming Frog tutorial, just go onto YouTube, type in Screaming Frog uh, Chase Reiner, and you'll be able to figure out how to do an audit with Screaming Frog. All right, so next we got outreach now this is something that can be applied in pretty much every niche everybody like most people need outreach so if we go to uh, buzzstream you can use this tool which will let you do outreach for people i will have a tutorial for this in the future if you would like to see that let me know um, but there are a couple things that you can do you can uh, do outreach for people and get them uh, interviews on youtube uh, you can do outreach for links. You can do outreach for clients to get clients and target people within a certain area. Um, 
but ideally you can do all of this in a really automated way just by learning this tool that's only $20 a month. So if you want to check out Buzzstream, I would really uh, recommend you check out this tool. It's a way that you can start doing outreach at a large scale for very cheap and it doesn't take a lot to learn. And last thing I'm going to put on here is that you can do Squarespace websites. Um, WordPress is a little bit harder to learn, but Squarespace is extremely easy to learn. Uh, all you have to do is learn basically how to drag and drop things. Uh, once you do that, you can pretty much just go into Squarespace. I'll show you what this looks like. And you can start creating websites for people within like a day. Uh, so you can see here, I'll just add a new page so you can see how this works. Click on that, go to pages. Say we want to add a new page like this. Call it example page. It'll have all these different templates that you can use. So I'll just use this blank template. And say we want to take this video that we're, we're talking about Screaming Frog and put it in there. All we have to do is just press this. It'll give a list of all the different things that we can use, like video. Put that in there. Apply. Say we wanted to make this smaller and add some text. We could just go here, you know, add some text. Say this is some text and save. Oops, sorry, let me go back. And then we're gonna edit the page, put this over here. Now we got the video with some text and then say we wanted to, you know, add like a mail sign up or something, you know, get more free tips in the future. We could add our, you know, newsletter here. I mean, it's all very fast. So obviously there's like, you have to learn a little bit here, but you know, it's not really complicated like some other website builders. And it's also not terrible like other website builders, like never use Wix. Squarespace is a great place to start. You could easily start charging, you know, a thousand dollars or under, uh, to make websites for people. And you could learn this literally like in seconds, not in seconds, but like within a day, if you just start looking up a couple Squarespace tutorials and that's how you can start making $200 an hour doing things on the internet that are part time, but also not extremely difficult. So as I said before, if you guys like these videos, make sure you leave a thumbs up and let me know, hit the subscribe button. So you get notified with the bell icon for future, uh, giveaways, streams, stuff like that. And if you guys have any questions, all you have to do is send me an email at hello at and I'll hopefully be able to answer any questions you have, or just leave a comment on YouTube. So that's it for today. Thank you guys for joining. Um, looks like we have a couple people, uh, asking some questions. So what I'm going to do before I sign off is I'm going to, as usual, answer a couple of questions. If you guys have any questions, make sure you leave one right now before I sign off. So we got Max saying, hi, Chase. What's up, Max? Christopher, sup, Chase? You got a new office. You redecorated. Also, if you guys like this video, for those of you who are on here right now, make sure you leave a one in the comments and let me know. Okay. Uh, Christopher says, can Google My Business service area be the whole of USA? Google Home and Business that is not really not local only and don't want to sh address shown. Yeah, you can. Um, I did that for like all of North America at one point. I think it might seem a little spammy, so I don't know if you want to do that. Um, so I'd be careful, but you definitely can. Darren says, what's good, Chase? What's up, Darren? Andrew says, you are awesome. Thanks, Andrew. Max says, thanks, Chase. Thank you. And we got a one from Max, a one from Michael, a one from you didn't know, a one from Jeff, and a one from Andrew. Andrew says, I can't wait to learn from you. I'm looking at purchasing a few of your packages, any bulk deals. So the only bulk deal we have right now is the Nexus bundle. And this is all of my courses plus a year access to my mastermind with all of my agency templates, my roadmap templates and everything. Um, all you have to do is go to chasereiner.com and I believe it's Nexus bundle. Let me see if I can find it. Nexus slash bundle. <clears throat> I don't even know if it's available anymore. Let me see if I can get it. Uh, and pretty much what this is, like I said, is it's everything that I've worked on in the last year. Uh, if you guys do want this, let me know. I can try to find a link for it um, and leave it in the in the description. But I mean, this is hours and hours. Oh, here it is. This is hours and hours and hours of me working. 
uh, over the last year, basically for 997. I mean, you don't even get college courses this cheap. So, uh, I mean, this is the kind of stuff that like will literally take you from making zero dollars a month to where I'm at, like twenty to thirty thousand dollars a month at the age of 24, and being able to do what you want, like wherever you want. So if you want that, I'll leave that in the description. I'll just leave that in the chat right now. And with that, I'm going to sign off. Um, I'm going to be making some more videos like this in the future. Uh, so hopefully I'll see you guys then. And until I see you all next time, happy SEOing.